Chen Wen Zhang versus Diana Yashemska is the second semi-final for the ladies Australian Open for 2024. And both have been super impressive in such a random section of the draw. Yastremska entered the tournament as a qualifier and will take on the number seven seed Von Drusova. But after winning the first set easily, she would go on to destroy the Wimbledon champion 6-1, 6-2. In the second round, she'd take on Kracheva and again would win easily 6-3, 6-2. In the third round, she'd take on the 27 seed Navarro. And after dropping the second set, would run away with the third, 6 2, 2 6, 6 1. In the fourth round, she'd take on the 18 seed Azarenka. And after a very close first set, she would fight back to win in the second, 7 6, 6 4, to make it to the quarterfinals. In the quarterfinals, Yastremska took on Noskova, who had taken out Sviontek a couple of days earlier. There's no problem for Yastremska getting through in straights. 6-3, 6-4 to advance to the semifinals. Zhang entered the tournament as the number 12 seed. and will take on Kruger in the first round. And after dropping the first set, would fight back to win. 3-6, 6-2, 6-3. In the second round, she'd take on Bolter. There's no problem getting through in straights. 6-3, 6-3. In the third round, she'd take on fellow Chinese woman Wong, who had taken out Kasteya and Rodokanu along the way. And this was an epic, with Zhang having to fight to the tiebreak in the third, eventually winning in three, 6 3, 2 6, 7 6. In the fourth round, she'd take on Dodden. Another unseated surprise, as we've seen so much throughout this tournament, was with no problem for Zhang winning in less than an hour, 6 love 6 3, to make it to another quarterfinal of a slam. In the quarterfinals, Zhang would take on the unseated Kalinskaya, who had had the benefit of avoiding Rabakina along the way. And after dropping the first set, Zhang would fight back to win. 6 7 6 3 6 1 to advance to the semi finals. These two have actually never played before, so this is going to be a really interesting contest between the big serving of Zhang and also the really big hitting of Yastremska, which was really impressive against someone like Niskova in the previous round. If Yastremska is going to win this one, she needs to get Zhang off balance. Try and push her around like she did against Niskova because Niskova does have a big serve, very similar to Zhang, but Zhang does have probably better movement than Niskova, so Yastremska is really going to have to move Zhang around the court and really produce those winners that helped her win the last round. If Zhang's going to win, it's all about the serve. She's got to serve big and also maybe go for the down the line back in a little more. It works so well against Kalinskaya after the first set. She probably also has to win the first set as well because Jastremska seems to be a little bit of a front runner with this tournament, especially having come through with a lot of matches and the qualies. What a great matchup. Such a random matchup, but it's also two younger players. So might not be the last time we see them play semis, especially if you're young. I'm going to go with Jung in three. I reckon she beat Jastremska and the dream run stops now as a qualifier. I mean, what a run going to the semis. But I think Jung's time is now and she's going to make the final. Let me know down the comments below. Who do you have in the final?